Uh, the men is the best men's team that the school has ever seen. By far the biggest group, uh, most records we've ever broken, and the best ranking going into championships that we've ever had. Um, and I think we're going to actually hang pretty well in that eighth place spot, um, hoping to, to eclipse seventh place. Uh, at the end. So definitely trying to take a step up if we can. So Sean has been absolutely integral since day one. He came in extra motivated this year because his season was kind of interrupted last year with uh, COVID protocols and things going on with that. So he came back with a just kind of a new, a new spirit, a new uh, uh, motivation. And he's just been firing on all cylinders since the beginning of the year. I mean, he set that 50 freestyle record on a random um, November uh, dual meet. And so he is primed to go. And uh, he, we found out he can swim back, backstroke this year. Last year, we thought he was a butterflyer and his backstroke just shined really well this year. So setting those records in backstroke has been absolutely great. And it's been benefiting his uh, freestyle style as well. So the women are on the rise, uh, way better than we've had last year, and there's been some growing pains on that side of things as well, but for the better. You know, being able to go in with full rosters of re relays, and uh, actually our women are, are scheduled to outscore our men. They look fantastic, and there's uh, the last week of taper or whatever has been phenomenal for the women. Um, they're, they're hitting some times that they haven't been able to do this season so far, and so I'm really excited to see what, what's in store for them. This year, with the bigger rosters and with the influx of talent uh, in our, with our freshman class, we are really looking at experience. And it's funny, I was thinking about it, even our upperclassmen have only really had one year of experience at championships because even two years ago it was a COVID year and they didn't have a full championship experience. So if anything, it's really just learning. Um, the one thing we're excited the most for though is having a huge spectator gallery this year. Um, and we've gone all in with, with some spirit wear and some, um, I guess you could call them knickknacks to, to, to play with up in the, uh, the spectator gallery. So we're gonna be loud, we're gonna be proud, and we're gonna try to, uh, at least with our team spirit, be able to uh, launch uh, each swimmer to maybe another level they weren't capable of before, so.